These days, we are all scared of the new airborne contagious coronavirus. Since its outbreak, the life of millions have been impacted, and relevant news has been exploding on all platforms. In this situation, we thought it'd be necessary to collect real-time data from both official and unofficial sources, so that the public can have a fair-minded understanding of this outbreak with transparent data sources. To pull data from these sources, you can take advantage of web scraping tools like Octopus, as they build web scraping templates to extract data on China's government report. This can keep you updated with the latest information. Now let's take a look at how to use the template to extract live data. Launch the Octopus in your computer and build a scraping task by clicking Task Template. Notice that there are numbers of scraping recipes ranging from e-commerce websites to social media channels. These are pre-formatted crawlers that can be used to extract data from target websites directly. Under the Live category, choose National Healthcare Commission. You can see that there are two templates. One is for extracting government news and announcement. The other is for extracting live data, including the confirmed cases, the recovery, death toll, and fatality rate in each city of China. Now click Real-Time Data 2019 Encove, as we want to extract live data. There's no need for configuration. Simply start the extraction, and Octopus will automatically scrape the data at ease. You can export the data into many formats, such as Excel, JSON. CSV and to your own database via API. You can also extract real-time information on social media channels. There are templates covering dozens of platforms such as Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. For example, if you want to extract the latest tweets about the virus and see how people are reacting to it, you may take advantage of this latest tweet template. It's designed to collect the latest tweets containing the search keyword that you put into. It allows you to extract web page URL, tweet URL, to handlers, posts, etc. Now let's run this template. Open Twitter, type in coronavirus, and click on the latest tab. Copy the URL and paste it into the first parameter. Twitter applies infinite scrolling technique, which means that we have to set a scrolling number until we get the desired number of posts. You can set any number you like, from one to ten thousand. The idea is to get the page fully loaded. Some hot topics certainly will attract more people to tweet, like coronavirus. At this point, let's say we need to scroll ten times. After that, we can go ahead and execute a scraper by clicking Save and Run, and you'll get the results instantly. We've covered how to use web scraping template to extract real-time data about coronavirus in this video. If you also want to build your own scraper to extract articles from news portals like Wall Street Journal, New York Times, and Reuters, you may check out this video.